Hey guys, Desolator Magic here, and scientists are uh, developing brave new ways to break the game and do degenerate crap that would look a little bit OP in a vintage game. And I have found, thanks to my opponent here, which I would have written out his username, I'd love to you know, credit him with the discovery, but honestly, he probably copied it from someone, but I haven't seen this yet. So he could be the OP on this. Uh, but he found a more degenerate combo than anything in my deck, which, okay, <laughs> this, that speaks for itself. And uh, I did gamble a bit on the Scoot Swarm there. By the way, Scoot Swarm is going to be banned. It is it is going to be banned. I would stake a million dollars on it. Scoot Mob is going, or Scoot Swarm. I keep calling it Scoot Mob because that card's baller too. But Scoot Swarm is going to be banned and you're about to see why. So he is running a two color Landfall Mutate deck that's just one giant loop. It's more efficient than my deck, but watch till the end. You guys know I don't just, you know, I gotta, I gotta give him a custom one. I don't just say that because it's a funny haha -ha YouTube thing to say. I say it because I'm either about to get hit in the balls with a coconut electrocute myself almost to death or some crazy shit is about to happen in arena. I think those are the only three times I said, make sure you watch till the end. So <laughs> here we go. And, and spoiler alert, I don't get electrocuted. <laughs> now that's a ballsy swing right there. That's ballsy. I, I almost thought after I swung, I'm like, does he not want either of us to have this? Now here's the thing. Okay. So great horn. Okay. When he mutates, he gets to drop in a land and then, okay. Scoot swarm. Okay. Okay. I mean, all right. So now every time he mutates, he gets a free land. That's interesting. Probably not interesting to build my deck around it, but I think you guys who know the rules really, 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 really well are about to see why this is about to be a problem. Ah, oh, here we go. I got pretty good pulls though, but, um, the, the, now I'm at six. So I'm like, okay, we're sitting pretty, right? Here it goes. Ready, set. Oh, wait. It cloned him exactly as is because they're all one merged together creature. Oh, shit. So there's four of them. There's Uro. He gets to go draw a card and then put another land into play. So he puts another land into play. There we go. We got more of them. There we go. There it is. Thanks for that. Appreciate it. So now he's got an army of... Uh, 24 damage, which ironically I'm sitting on 24. I'm like, well, I'm not going to forfeit just because of that broken combo. Look what deck I'm running. So I'm like, I got Uro too, bitch. Let's go, you know? Ugin, what's good, homie? So let's see. What do I end up dropping in? I wanted to do Valakut, but I thought, I think, no, I guess I really wanted to do Valakut. Okay, <laughs> whatever. Well, I've got the Dryad sitting right there. So I guess I just wanted to outswarm him. I thought if I can get to, because it goes, you know, 8, 16, 32, whatever. So I don't care if they're three power, they don't have trample. Here's the problem. He just morphed again. And that, uh, what does it do? It goes, oh, it destroys a enchantment. So that's a problem for me. But then also it goes to fetch a land. So now he's got a bunch of those. And he gets way, way, way up there. There it is. There is where it gets broken. Yeah. Can you believe somebody would be allowed to do this? How would you even do this in paper? This game is no longer playable in paper. And I don't mean this game particularly. I mean Magic the Gathering. Might have heard of it. All right. So he's going to swing for like 21. So I'm not scared. Oh, it's a little higher with him. Oh, there we go. There it is. I knew he found a different way to do it. So every time he drops in a land, draws a land and, and drops in a land or morphs or what mutates, whatever the hell, a creature, he also gets to go get a land. Yeah. They're going to have to ban Scoot Mob or Scoot, whatever, Scoot, whatever the hell this thing is. All right, here we go. So you might think, okay, a normal person would forfeit when they see 200 damage in play, right? Uh, bitch, I've got Ugin <laughs> and I've got Omnath. So I, I quickly plan this out in my head. I'm like, oh, that's like more than eight, isn't it? <laughs> Only if I do Lotus Cobra. Or at least I think I could get away with a Lotus Cobra is what I should have said. So uh, there's my last two. Thank God I got those. I might uh, up the amount of basic lands in this deck as I tune the deck when they're going to probably ban it tomorrow. I, I think they have enough data on this. They, just, watching this video is enough data to know that you're going to have to ban Scoot Swarm. This old Scooty boy. People said the Scoots aren't good, but they were wrong. And there it is. That's eight. Hi, Ugin. What do those cost again? You know what? I actually don't know the answer, so I select four. 
<laughs> just like a multiple choice test. I don't actually know what the actual CMC of that actual permanent is. And you know, you know, I'm going to oops him. You know, I'm going to drop that oops on a bitch. Of course I just oopsed him. That was a big oopsie. That was oopsie doopsie and boopsie. I'm quoting Jeremy all day today, <laughs> but you know what? Such strong language is merited. <laughs> so g get this. This is his comeback. Yeah. Another cultivate with a heron into, spoiler alert, another heron. So anytime he mutates, he gets to draw two cards. Or three, three, I don't even, I don't play mutate, it's such bullshit. They should just take every card with mutate and ban it, that would be a start. But yeah, even without mutate, scoot swarm is the problem. So, kiss that bullshit goodbye. So I get a free card off this. The order I do this in is a little bit questionable. Um, because the great henge taps for two. And I think I didn't realize that. I don't know. I think I didn't have five regardless, but, uh, I think I could have gotten a free card out of that somewhere. I don't know, whatever. Next turn I hit him hard. So I'm not happy with the state of things because he could basically just fill his hand to seven every single turn, like reliably. Um, there's another cultivate. I mean, my God, like talk about rigged. <laughs> if he still had scoot swarm in play, he would have probably crashed the game by now. He'd have 500, a thousand of them. I don't even know. He doesn't have a double drop dryad, but he almost wouldn't even need it. Om um, nom nom nath. All right, so I could wipe the heron, but I've literally got Omnath sitting right there. But I thought, let's take a shot at it with Earl first, okay? And also, I already plus three him. <laughs> so I guess I made, I'm like, he's not going to die. I made my mind up. He can draw all the cards he wants. I'm very much confidently showboating my ass off right now. Then I realized that if I pay three for that, <laughs> or whatever it is, yeah, then I can tap it for two so thank god i finally realized that oh is that a land i think it is guys <laughs> oh shit last land i gotta put more basics in this deck I, I don't like the lack of fixing uh without the triumphs though i might dump the temples but i kind of like the scry too so i don't know i don't know they come in tapped i mean what are you gonna do why am I even narrating the rest of this? I should have just like like five X through this. Like obviously I win. <laughs> I mean, he swings at Ugin and then he's like, you know what? F my life. I'm out of here. And he just leaves. So <laughs> um yeah, this is this is embarrassing for wizards. This is downright. I'm not even gonna be like, what the hell, wizards, fix this immediately. Rawr, I'm mad. I'm just disappointed. Like, your parents ever get so mad at you that they're just disappointed? I'm just disappointed in my kids, which is Wizards of the Coast. That's right. Papa Des here, telling it like it is, showing what's going on. This combo needs to be shut down immediately. At least you guys found it entertaining while it lasts. I, I am kind of borderline no longer finding anything about this launch entertaining because I want to play the f game, but... uh. Ah, whatever. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next dumpster fire of a video. The content, not the editing, whatever.